Hi, everyone. Welcome back to the C Morning Show. We're almost at the halfway point of our program, which usually leads us to our first discussion yes. of the day. And Exciting one. As we all know, Karina, mm -hmm. education is a human right, a public good, and as well, a public responsibility. In fact, the United Nations has proclaimed today, January the 24th, as the International Day of Education in celebration of the role of education in fostering peace and development. That's right, Fina. And speaking of education, there are so many ways to make learning fun through entertainment activities like songs and puppet shows. And this morning, we have the team behind entertainment series, Domikado, with us. So let's say hey. hello to Angia Charisma and Ryan Ariandi. Good, uh, good morning, guys. guys. Good morning. Hello. So they are the creators of Domikado. And in case you're not familiar with Domikado, could you introduce us to Domikado and some of the characters that are involved? In okay, so uh, thank you for inviting us thank here. Thank you for being here. Yeah, it's very nice to be here. Well, actually, Domikado is a form of a series, mm -hmm. uh, contains with a Papa shows. We create it in a form that very entertaining mm -hmm. to help children not only learning, but playing in so much fun way. Okay. And there are six of it, actually, at the end. We have six characters okay. right now. Yeah. We have six friends that will help um, uh, children to learn and play in, yep. uh, in a place what we call uh, Domikado Park. So it's actually like, okay. a, like a play park. Uh, we have Astrobek. Uh, he's a he's a very curious uh, science enthusiast, mm -hmm. and then we have Cheese Cheese. He's the very um, calm and collected cat, and yeah. then Bea is a is actually a Beonias from Indonesia that really loves music and tunes. Okay. And then Cricket, we have a Shih Tzu dog that is very curious, and then we have Beo, which is like a sparrow. Mm -hmm. uh, We're missing one in the picture here. What yeah. Is that six? It's actually you will see the sixth character yeah. if you watch the program. Ah. Like Up in that. the sky, uh, her name is Odie, yeah, it's and a cloud. she's she's a cloud. <laughs> oh. she's, she will be the narrator that welcomes people I to see. the park. So I noticed when you mentioned, like for example, Astrobek, science, yeah. uh, Bea, music. Mm -hmm. Is so you're all themed by subjects. I noticed. Is that like is that done on purpose? Yeah, yep. we've well, done it by purpose, but we try to combining the model of education in Indonesia, especially for the. Um, early child education. Yeah. So we want to provide all the things that combining the education with entertainment, but also relaxing right. to make it fun away. So yeah. all the people in a family can gather together and maybe you guys also can enjoy it. Right. Yeah. So it's a Watch fun, it with our kids. Yeah, yeah. watch it with your kids, right. but maybe it's, we create it not only for the kids, but for the kids inside and, of us. Oh, I love the inner that. child. <laughs> the inner the child. child. Her, she's got an inner child that sometimes <laughs> likes to come outside yeah, too yeah, and outside. play. <laughs> so, when and how did you guys come together to create Domicado? So, uh, we're actually from uh, the Cinema Studios. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, and then uh, we, uh, the, the, the actual uh, initiation for the idea was what happened during the pandemic. Yeah. That, uh, because a lot of uh, school, uh, activities like transferred into shifted home, online? yeah, shifted right. online, and then we thought, I think we sh it's time for us to to, to give, create something, to create something, right. and to give uh, Indonesian children new yeah. friends, mm. like to accompany them, study at, at home, and play yeah. with their families, and then so Domikado came up. Domikado came up because we believe that the golden period of that era for kids mm -hmm. in the early childhood is really yeah. matters. Okay, so they lost the three years important in their life, right? Yeah. Yeah. So that's uh, what we thought about it. And it's been like our concern since we are the creator and a storyteller. So we have to make something that matters for yep. our children. So it's our legacy mm. to be yeah. given on, to pass it on away right. our uh, child right. and also the family for Indonesia. So they have the new icon for the educational yeah. thing. You know, um, when I first we started uh, just checking out like Domicado for for our discussion here today, it rem I don't know if you grew up uh, with Sesame Street. I did. I, well, Sesame Street I, yeah, around yeah. for like yeah. decades. Yeah. Yeah. It, it's like that. That's what I think of right away. It's almost right. like we're introduced to the characters. We know all the characters very well. Mm -hmm. But in every episode, there is a certain lesson to be learned. Yes. Yeah. Is that the idea behind Domicado as well? 
Yeah, because this is yeah. uh, we designed this to be an edutainment program. Okay. Right. So we try to find the sweet spot, the balance between education and entertainment. That's why we, we come up with these characters where we hope that children and family can find somebody they can relate to, they can resonate to. Right. And also, um, the, 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 the format is not only puppet show, we also have different style of animation, ah. songs, guest stars. So okay. we wouldn't blame you if you immediately think of Upsy Sammy Street because right. it feels like home, right? Yeah, right. I like yeah. That. Yeah. It feels like familiar. Yeah, it's it familiar. Yeah. As well. And yeah. also, it's not just it's not just academic subjects. We also right. talk about psychosocial, like yeah. the little things that uh, children also need to learn about how to interact with people and family and friends. Yeah, and the core value actually for the Domicado itself is we want to uh, talk things not only more about giving in, mm -hmm. but the very more important about it is more about to increasing your empathy and empathy, yeah. I see. ourself. How to be a good person. Yeah, yeah. It's not only being a good person, but being kind to, to all, all beings. beings. Right. So right. that's what matters most right now. Right. So we try to make uh, this Domicado is more like an inclusive mm -hmm. theme and also the diversity that we want to embrace about it because we live yeah. in Indonesia. Right. We have lots of differences, yeah. but it's like it's our culture right. yeah. to be embraced. And, and, and being like learning online, I can tell you that kids socialize less and they l not, don't learn about these differences as much. Exactly. They do learn academically yeah. easily online, but they don't get to interact with others as well. Yes, yeah. but because the educational is not only in schools, right? Mm -hmm. Right. You can find it also somewhere else. Daily lives. Daily lives. Yeah. Daily lives. Every day. Yeah, but the thing is how to empower the kids and they are able not only to coping with the hardships, yeah. but the very important is when they are coping with the hardships, they are not alone. They have Domicado friends, right. and they have <laughs> us, like the parents and the caretaker itself. Yeah. That's a really good um, hmm. principle to have, I feel like. Teach them at young, right? And I feel like yeah. this is also something you don't really um, and are coping, taught in school. Yeah, yeah, and coping with all those certain of feelings but sometimes we are forget that we are once as a kid. Mm -hmm. Right. What they are talking about is almost the same matters that we want to talk about right now. So that's why Domicado is very important. Yeah. So we want to create Domicado. It's not only a, not only to celebrate, you know, the educational part, but we want Domicado is being alive, yeah. Yeah. Being our real friends that we can grow up with. Right. 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 So, uh, speaking of uh, which then, what age group is this appropriate for and how do you kind of manage your content so you can kind of cater to like the younger kids and so the older kids yeah. will be interested as well? Yeah, so we actually spent uh, two years in development for this yes. uh, during the pandemic from 2020. We have, uh, we, we've collaborated with writers and... We're doing some yeah, research also. We, we did research team, uh, we, we have a research team that yeah. um, that, that focuses on the um, the development of the curriculum. Okay. So the age group that we're um, uh, we're trying to reach is um, four to eight. Oh, four to yeah, eight. Yeah. So okay. it's that golden. It's era. very crucial age, isn't it? Yeah. Exactly. Learning. Exactly. That's the golden period era. So right. they have to know the uh, development right. for everything, yeah. not only about the cognitive, but only about mm -hmm. uh, not only about the cognitive, but also the sensory part mm -hmm. and the motoric yeah. part. So mm -hmm. so and then we we we, we try to to uh, transform those yeah. curriculum into like an interesting story. Right. Because right. each episode, we range from eight to 11 minutes per yeah. episode. Oh, okay. And then uh, I think that's like a perfect duration. Transform content. Yeah. 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 Right. yeah. So we uh, so we try, because we know the age group uh, uh, that we are aiming for. So we try to develop characters and stories that, that can, they can enjoy and the education is like mixed into the uh, right. story. Yeah, that's and perfect. because it is a very delicate kind of um, yeah program and contain. So we try to manage uh, in a very efficient mm. and yeah. very entertaining also. Mm. And I think what is most important about Domicado, like we all know right here, these days, there's only like 0.7% uh, content that providing right. and can be... Children. Really? Less yeah. than 1%? Less than 1%. Less than 1%. <laughs> Yeah. So I think we can fill in into the gap, and like Rian said, we try to fit into the sweet spot. Yep. And yeah. hopefully Domicado uh, 
can become our friends. Yeah. Not only for today, but it's to come. Yeah. For the, the way child we, inside of us. Yeah. Yeah. The way we vision it is because we want to make learning fun, right? So yeah. we try to avoid avoid teaching them or like talking down to kids. So we create yeah. these characters, we create these stories so that children and family will learn with the characters. Right. So together as yeah, a Yeah, so together. in the story, the characters will experience things, will discover things, and then they will learn together. Yeah, oh, and yeah. kids can relate to that. Yeah, exactly. And Domikada actually deliver in Bahasa Indonesia. Oh. Mm. Very important these days because yeah. kids are picking up Losing English it. so easily. Yeah. 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 Whereas we're starting to, hey, how come their English is much better than Bahasa? <laughs> Bahasa. I've kind of put that, uh, like kind of in um, in school, I remember because we just switched schools for my right. kid. Now, is that the case for your kids? Yeah, and uh, yeah. they're like, uh, we have to warn you though, our our school teaches in full Bahasa. I'm like, no, that's totally fine. Because yeah, the kids these days are <laughs> English, English at home exactly. and with what they watch, right? Yeah, that's why we want to make it very inclusive. So right. That's yeah. why we deliver it in Bahasa. Indonesia. Perfect. Yeah. And we also have a tagline for uh, our uh, show. It's called Taman untuk semua teman. Okay. So it's actually. Uh, it resonates with our theme, which is like, yeah. it's an inclusive park. Mm -hmm. Everyone can come and learn. Forever. And it's actually also like a good word play of Taman and Teman, right? Yes. So it's like yeah. a Taman and Teman. Taman. Taman. <laughs> Very rhyming, yeah. right? Nice. Yeah. Uh, uh. And it's a fun place to sitting, to feel good about yeah. yourself. And sometimes, well, you know, these days, uh, many disruptions that we have as a right. parent. We sometimes forget to leave our devices when Absolutely. we're talking about the kids. Mm -hmm. you know? yeah. So, yeah. I think Taman Domikado is a place where everyone can feel joy about it. Everyone. Yeah. Now, you guys obviously made some friends here, you know, like if he's, if he's mentioned, um, six friends yeah. that's inclusive to everyone. And um, I think I'd be really excited to meet one of them that I heard is actually in the studio no with us today. Yeah. Um, Astrobeck. My favorite character. Where? Hello, where is Astrobeck? I feel like I saw Astrobeck. <laughs> yeah. oh, 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 where is everybody? Hey, where are we here? Hello. Hi. 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 Oh my gosh, look at you. Hi. 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 How are you? How are you today? Hi. Were you there the whole time, Astrobeck? What? Were you there the whole time? Were you listening to us? No, talking? no, no. You just arrived? I'm from the canteen and um, I'm We're from the canteen. <laughs> Got some coffee, right? Some morning because coffee. Because we need to remind children that breakfasts are important, right? Yeah, yeah. that's right. Okay. One important meal of the day. Oh, <laughs> true. That's true. Now, Astrobeck, I heard you are an astronaut, but you're uh, also a detective. So can you please tell us a little bit more about that? How does that in line together? Uh, because Astrobeck is uh, so... So, 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 so altruistic to, to knowledge, you know? Oh. And, uh, Very curious. To be an and to be a detective, you need to have a lot of knowledge yeah. and uh, a lot of things to be shared. So it's it's really, really fun to uh, to be an astronaut and to be a, a detective. Yeah. What do wow. you, what is your favorite thing about science? Science? Yes. You love science, don't you? Yes. Okay, so what's your favorite thing that you like to share about science? Why do you think it's important for children to learn about science? Building a spaceship. <laughs> <laughs> right, you want to He's explore... He's got his costume on already. Yes, because I want to explore the whole universe. Wow. Yeah. And I want to be the first duck. <laughs> on Pluto. You want to be the first duck to land on Pluto? Really? Yeah, that, that's a very far goal. That's great. Okay, why, why Pluto, Astro? Yeah, why Pluto? Uh, why Pluto? Yeah. Because uh, there's already one duck who land on the moon. Oh. <laughs> right, right, right. Been there, done that. Yeah. Something new, please. Yeah, somebody's already been on the moon. Why would yeah. you? Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. great. Yeah. <laughs> you can see the fact on our uh, episodes, right? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, it's a story, one of the an episode you can... Yeah. Astrobeck, can yes. you tell us who is your best friend on Domikado? Out of all of your friends there, you have Tistis, Bea, Beo... You pick one. If one best friend. One, can you pick Is one? that a trick question? <laughs> <laughs> it, I think it is. I'm trying. I can't choose one of them. Oh. They're all of my best friends. Oh. Yeah. Yes. And actually in this, uh, uh, this is the 
International Educational Day, right? Correct. That yes. is right. right. So I want to have a lot, a lot more, more friends in the future. Yeah. 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 Well, you've a definitely best made in the future. two more friends today, along with my children, who I'll definitely steer towards watching you and your wonderful program. Oh, thank and you. on this special International Day of Education, what is your one biggest wish for all the children out there? Well, thank you. <laughs> What's your What's wish? Question? What would be your wish on this? Oh, my wish for all the children. Oh, uh, besides, uh, to be a uh, uh, besides going to be more <laughs> friends, right? Okay, <clears throat> I want to have uh, our my friends around the world to have a better education. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, I want to be a writer. Oh. You want to be a writer? I want to be a writer. Wow. I want to write uh, a whole science knowledge mm. so wow. I can share it with my uh, friends around the world. Wow. And. They have uh, better knowledge and better education. Okay. Thank oh, you. I love that. That's Thank so lovely. So That's wonderful. so lovely. Astrobeck. Thank you so much, Astro. So, Astrobeck, you sound like a very busy duck. You've got so many things to do on the go. <laughs> oh, yeah. so. Like preparing to go to Pluto. We I don't want to keep my you. breakfast, actually. All right. <laughs> Thank you. We'll let you go back to your breakfast. Thank you so much. Thank you, Karina, Paul. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye, Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. See you in the park. Bye-bye. Yeah. Bye-bye. Wow. So we oh got gosh. to meet one of the characters. This my is kid so will be so jealous. I want to go to Pluto with you. Yeah. <laughs> if you want to meet, like, the other five, just go to the Domicado YouTube channel. Right. There you go. Yeah, we release a new episode every Friday. How many episodes have you guys done so far? 24, 24 episodes. Four. Okay. Yeah, for one season. For this, one season. There must be challenges. Obviously, it's not easy to put out content like exactly. this. Exactly. <laughs> Tell us about some of the more difficult challenges that you have had to counter throughout this process. Oh. I think there's plenty of challenge yeah. <laughs> things doing this Domicado content, but one of the challenges is that we try to find uh, how to develop the puppet itself mm. because yeah, it's yeah. very rare in Indonesia. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And we try to uh, find it yeah, with Rian and we do some research from UK to US. Mm. But yeah. finally, we found it right here in our heart in Jakarta. Oh, here. Wow. Yeah. Capital City. This is Indonesian made. Wow. Like, all of yeah. it, like 100% Indonesian made. Yeah. yeah. And I happen to be the uh, character designer because yeah. I have an illustration background. Ah, there so, you yeah, and then one of the challenges is how to find the soul and the character yeah. that, that uh, the very distinct characteristic between uh, these six characters and how we know what kind of story and what kind of um, situations they'd be in. Mm. Right. Uh, and also, we also have some topics yeah. that we really think that it's important for families and children and we right. have to find a way to delicately communicate yes, that to topic. adapt it into a story yeah. that kids can yeah. relate to yeah. so uh since astrobeck is gone uh <laughs> since you created the character do you have a favorite character <laughs> i love all of them actually like actually um all your babies that are all my babies <laughs> all our babies and actually like uh it's very interesting because we introduced the first six Okay. So okay. it's actually a bigger roster of wow, characters. Wow! Yeah. This park is actually very crowded. <laughs> very but crowded. we will introduce them to you slowly. like little, yeah, slowly. Nice. Yeah, step by step we will introduce yeah, it right. to you all. But the very important things before we find which character that we want to develop is uh, what kind of theme that we are going to be able to put in Domicado yeah. Park. Right. So right. that's why we put it about that. Yeah. yeah. Three pillars that we believe so about the inclusivity, diversity, and also the resilience. Resilience. Itself. resilience. Yeah. So how are we gonna make the character that more appealing not only to children, young children, yeah. but yeah. also for us as an adult. Very important. So Absolutely. it's very important for us yeah. to yeah. know yeah. them very well. Yeah. And so please come to our park. To we'll definitely come to our park. Yeah. <laughs> Now, uh, we asked Astrobeck this right before he left, guys, but on this International Education Day, what are your hopes for the education <laughs> of the future of the children, especially here in Indonesia? I believe that we are, as a caretaker, as a parent, is playing more important role to educate our children. If you want to have a kind of souls, then you have to be in kind with them. Right. If you want to have, a, you know, sort of things that we believe that children is also a precious human being. Mm -hmm. Treat them as a real human being. Mm -hmm. right. Not only you put the educational system on it, mm -hmm. they can learn from everywhere. Yeah. Not just about academics, right? Yeah. Not just about academics also, but 
I would believe that more inclusivity yep. is more important and I believe they have also the privilege to learn more about educational system. So I believe uh, we are the caretaker that going to provide it to our next generation. Yes. Well said. Yeah. yeah. And I also hope yeah. that we uh, understand more and more that education or like learning is like a two-way process. Mm -hmm. It's not just the children learning from adults. So we're also it's also, we also learn a lot from children. Very much. Very so. much right. Yes. And then um, I think, I hope that Domikado can be a reminder of that, that every day is a learning process. Every, yeah. every situation is a very good opportunity to spark meaningful conversations and like uh, how to view our world as a yeah. big learning place. Yes, absolutely, yeah. a big part that we can uh, all learn. Yeah. Yeah. I'm sure I speak on behalf of Karina as well, yeah. and I as a parent am very happy and thank you for providing this sort of learning platform, just thank something you. new to mm -hmm. supplement in addition to all the things that our kids can learn from. And we also thank you for joining us on this Thank you, it's our thank pleasure. You. Thank you for having us. Guys, please do tune in to the YouTube channel of Domicado with your kids as well. It's something that you can all do together as a family activity, especially today on the International Day of Education. We'd like to thank uh, Angia and Rian for yes. joining us today. Thank you. Yes, yes. But, uh, new episodes yep. every Friday. Every Friday, 4 p.m. Yeah, there you go, go guys. <laughs> <Tune in> guys. <laughs> All right, now on that note, we're due for another short break, but don't go anywhere because when we return, we will have more updates for you from around the world. Stay with us on the C Morning Show only on Sunday.